back for more lessons. All right, so we are still in the book, Speak Out Elementary. Now, before anything else, I want to ask you some questions, okay? So, uh, yes, you can pause the video and then uh, you'll have time to answer my questions, all right? So the first question is, what are you going to do this weekend? And the second one is, what languages do you want to learn aside from English? Okay, so after answering those questions, we will now proceed with the chapter 10.2. So the title for this chapter is, Survive. Okay, survive. You want to live. I want to survive. I don't want to die, right? Okay, so if you have your book right there, you can open it up and try to follow us with the review. Okay, so today's vocabulary is about phrases with get. Okay, so words that are accompanied with get. Okay, so for example, get hot. Get hot, okay? So in your book, if you have it there, it is actually in uh, page 100, it is 1C. Okay, I'm going to read the sentences. When I exercise in the gym, I get very hot. Okay? Next is wet. Of course, wet from the rain. So, example sentence. I forgot my umbrella yesterday and I got wet. Okay, I don't have an umbrella. I forgot. So, I got wet. Okay? Next is hungry. All right, get hungry. So, this is the sentence. Uh, I didn't eat breakfast, so I'm getting hungry. Okay? So, I'm getting hungry. It is very, it's a very useful sentence. So, if you're hungry, suddenly you're hungry, you can say, oh, I'm getting hungry. We should eat now. Okay? I'm getting hungry. Right? Next, thirsty. Okay, thirsty, uh, thirsty. So the sentence is, I didn't drink anything all day, so I got thirsty. Okay? You can, use, uh, you can also say, I'm getting thirsty. Let's drink some water. Okay? Next is bored. Okay, bored. Like, oh, I'm bored. It's not interesting. That movie is not interesting. I feel bored, okay? So in the book, it says, this exercise isn't very interesting. I'm getting bored, okay? I'm getting bored, so you're feeling it right now. Example, you're watching a movie. Like, suddenly you start to get bored. So, oh, I'm getting bored, okay? Uh, let's just go out, I'm getting bored, okay? So next is sunburn, okay? You burn your skin, okay? So. Uh, this is the sentence. I stayed out in the sun and got sunburned. I stayed out in the sun and got sunburned. Alright, so next is lost. So lost, you don't know the correct way, so you're lost. I didn't have a map, so I got lost. Of course, right? Okay, next. Tired. Okay, tired. Oh, I'm so tired. That. So I stayed up late and I got really tired. So I got tired because I didn't sleep well last night. All right? So let's try to practice each word, okay? So you can read with me or you can read after me, okay? So let's start. Hot, wet, hungry, thirsty, bored, sunburned, lost, Tired. Okay, so you can practice getting tired. Okay, getting lost, getting thirsty, getting hungry. Okay, got hungry, past tense, right? Got, so got bored. Okay, so you can practice making your own sentences. All right, so now let's continue with the grammar part of the book. It is will, might, and won't. Okay, will, something, that will happen, okay? It's will, it's uh, definitely will happen. Might, maybe it won't happen, maybe it will happen. And won't, 
it will not happen. Okay, so let's uh, try to check the, the grammar structure. The subject is I, you, he, she, it, we, they, and then you can use will or might or might not or won't plus the verb. All right. So if you have your book with you, you can actually open it up on uh, page 146. Okay, so page 146, you can actually uh, check out the sample sentences. All right, so I'm going to read some sentences here. Okay, so the first one is, I will go shopping. That means 100% definitely I will go shopping. All right, or I might go shopping. That means uh, maybe I will go shopping, maybe not. Okay, so I might not go shopping. Maybe the same. I might go shopping or maybe not. All right, and last one is I won't go shopping. That means that's zero percent. No, I will not go there. Okay, so I won't go shopping. All right, so will, yes might 50 50 won't zero percent okay so try to practice make your own sentences all right by the way if there's a question if it's a question it's will okay will plus subject for example will you go shopping okay will you go shopping question mark and it's not gonna work so will you go shopping so the will is here before the subject okay so might you go no okay we don't use that won't you go shopping yes if you're asking a question won't you go shopping with me all right it's also possible okay so yes you can practice making your own sentences and practice uh, asking questions okay and speaking of questions i have a question for you before we finish this video. Okay, so question one. Have you been in a dangerous situation before? Okay, and can you tell me what happened that time? All right, so tell me about the dangerous situation that you've experienced, okay? So you're gonna, uh, you can comment in your answers below or you can tell me your answers personally by visiting us here in Royal English. And yes, I'll see you in the next video. All right, so bye-bye.